vertical jump test. Okay, we're gonna be using the vertical jump to measure our ground force that we can create, how much vertical ground force we can create. So the first thing I'm gonna go over is show you how to set up the test, then I'm gonna go over the mechanics of the jump. So what we're gonna need is some chalk, all right? We're gonna find a wall, we're gonna reach as high as we can from our feet flat and mark a point on the wall, okay? Then we're gonna re-chalk up those fingers, set up for our jump alongside the wall, whatever side you want, whether it's left or right, then we're gonna jump, and mark that highest point. We'll take two to three jumps, measure the difference between the highest jump, and that's gonna be your vertical, okay? Now let's think about the jump mechanics themselves, okay? So the jump mechanics is we wanna be in that athletic position. So again, something around hip or shoulder width apart. And remember, we jump from our heels. So when we go into the ground, we wanna create ground force. So we wanna throw everything into the ground. So hands are going down all the way back, getting good extension because we're gonna be using these to help create momentum as we come up, okay? So everything's into the floor and then we're gonna go into triple extension. So get to those toes, heels, and then also to those hips fully extended as we jump up into the air and mark our highest point. And that's the vertical jump.